Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Friday, the 20th of December, 2019. Uh, Merry Christmas. It's getting very close to the Christmas day. And of course, for us in Dunamis, our biggest emphasis is a crossover night. Our topic today on the Seeds of Destiny is, your victory is sure. The Bible says, the Lord is with me. He is my helper. I will look in triumph on my enemies. Psalm 118 verse 7, that is in the NIV, thought for the day. Who surrounds you determines what you can survive or surmount. Who covers you determines what you can conquer. And who backs you determines what you can sack. Victory is the state of having won or a competition or a battle or succeeded in an effort. It is the act of being triumphant over the enemy or the challenges of life. People don't fight to lose. People fight in order to be victorious. The success of every game or competition is the reason for such a game or competition. From our anchor scripture above, it is critical to note that God with a man equals victory over the enemy. That's in Psalm 118 and verse 7. When an antelope has the backing of a lion, it can confront an elephant without fear. In the same manner, when you have the backing of God, you can humiliate any devil and conquer any confrontation of life. Understand this, that who surrounds you determines what you can surmount. Who covers you determines what you can conquer and who backs you determines what you can sack. Beloved, you may be faced with the battle of family or generational limitations, or witchcraft altars, or barrenness, or chronic poverty, or envy, or strife, or near success syndrome, or depression, or stagnation, or satanic inflicted affliction of the body, or spells, of disfavor or uselessness, whatever it is, but as long as you completely rely on God and make Jesus Christ the Lord of your life, winning is automatic, triumphant is mandatory, and victory is sure. Today, I prophesy to you that you are coming out victorious from every current challenge of your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Congratulations for the victory is sure. Remember this, that who surrounds you determines what you can surmount. And who covers you determines what you can conquer. And who backs you determines what you can sack. Praise the Lord. What's our assignment today? First and foremost, determine to maintain a buoyant relationship with God. Number two, let Jesus Christ be your Lord and the Lord of all your life so that he can have the space to fight for you. And thirdly, develop the consciousness that you are a victor and not a victim. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say, Lord, I thank you for your word to me today. I make demands on your grace to maintain a solid relationship with you. I ask for your help to be victorious over the confrontations of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. I'm glad you prayed that prayer, and I know that the Lord has answered. I'd like to pray for you. Want to make Jesus the Lord of your life? Simply say this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. Please come into my life and be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins. Make me a new person. I'm now born again in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. I pray for you today. Now, as the blessing of the Lord be unleashed on you and on all that you lay your hands to do, in this season, in Jesus' name, God bless you.